Hello everybody, welcome back. So in today's video, I'm gonna show you my favorites of the month. So I really hope that you guys enjoy. Let me know if you do. Don't forget to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe for, for more videos. If you wanna keep in touch with me, make me questions, be my friend, you can follow me on my Instagram. I'm gonna leave all my social media accounts down in the description box like I usually do. And let's get started. All right, so my first favorite is the KKW Beauty Skin Body Foundation. And I freaking, freaking love this body foundation just because I have a few veins uh, on my legs and I wanted to see if this was as good as the video she showed where she applied a little bit of this foundation on her grandma and friend covering uh, their veins. And that was the reason actually why I get impressed and I bought this. And this does not cover my veins 100%, but it does the work. It cover my veins if I apply two layers. Everything looks fantastic, very blurred. And even if you wanna use these on your chest, on your legs, wherever you wanna use it just to make your skin look um, blurred and uh, prettier, you can totally use these. Another thing that I really like is the fact that it comes with a lot of product. The only thing that I'm not into is that it's like naked and then the logo is naked as well. So I can't see the name really well but so if you have veins and you want to cover those imperfections on your body make sure to get this body foundation because it's absolutely bomb right so my next favorite is this patrick ta major glow highlighting spray in the shade look at her and i'm gonna be honest the first time that i got this i was a little bit skeptical and scared because i am used to use cream highlighters powder highlighters but never a spray highlighter and it just made me look that i'm healthy from the inside to the outside and the way i like to apply this is spraying a little bit of these on the back of my hand and i cannot spray these directly on my face i am I just can't, I get, I get super, super scared. So that's the way I like to use these. Another thing that I really like is the fact that even though it's like a white pearly highlighter, once you apply it and you blend it into the skin, everything looks super beautiful. And I really, really love this. I'm gonna spray a little bit on my shoulder so you guys can see the magic. Yes. Come on, yes, I'm true. Okay, applying. Yes. Thank you. All right, so I have another highlight, and this one is affordable, and it's absolutely amazing. Just as good as the Patrick Ta highlighter. This one, obviously, it's a powder formula, and it's from Wet n Wild. The highlighter that I really, really been enjoying is the Golden Flower Canopy, and this is like a goldenish kind of highlighter, and it's just so, so beautiful. This is a highlighter that I'm wearing right now, and as you can see, we are blinding people, and it looks so freaking stunning. I'm gonna apply a little bit more because you know so you guys can see how beautiful this is but i freaking love this it looks phenomenal on the skin it's golden but it's not super super dark so it's gonna look really amazing if you have like my same skin complexion it's just gonna look perfect on you i freaking love this all right so next i have right here the tosh in soul no pore blem primer and I've been enjoying this primer so, so much just because I feel like uh, when I have texture, I apply this primer before my foundation and it helps with the texture on my skin. And I am absolutely obsessed. I have days where my skin is just beautiful and popping with no texture. And then I have days where my skin doesn't want to behave. And this has been a really, really good primer for those days where my skin is cranky all right so next i'm going to show you an eyeshadow palette that i have been using a lot and it's from the drugstore it's the covergirl revolution eyeshadow palette really been loving this uh, eyeshadow palette because as you may know uh finding good eyeshadow palettes on the drugstore sometimes can be a little bit challenging so this one in particular i really really like because you have pretty much everything you need to create any kind of look including uh colorful looks if you are feeling playful like this really pretty blue right here and the pigmentation on these matte shades are really really nice they blend pretty well i did a look using this eyeshadow palette here and i have been using this non-stop especially the matte shades all right so that's pretty much it i really hope you guys enjoy let me know if you did and i will see you until the next time